any patient with immunocompromised status with these viral infections, opportunistic infections. So there is something called as cellular virus directed immunotherapy, right? So you uh, collect the, uh, you know, the, the lymphocytes which are trained to act against the virus infected cells and that's how, that's one part of immunotherapy. People are confusing you with stem cell therapy. Uh, so that is one part. So cellular immunotherapy, yes, it has worked in many serious viral infections uh, in um, in the arena of transplant. So it might work in uh, coronavirus infections also. Apart from that, there is something called as an experimental phase of stem cell therapy, where wherein they collect the umbilical cord blood stem cells, which are immunologically naive st uh, stem cells or mesenchymal stem cells, which helps. Uh, to heal the affected part by the COVID infection. It is postulated that these, uh, you know, immunologically naive stem cells will go to the area of affected uh, organ and will regenerate the damaged cells and that's how it might work. But then uh, there are some preliminary reports uh, coming from mostly from China and uh, Europe and North American continent. Uh, the preliminary report seems to be promising, but we cannot conclude what is the effect uh, you know the uh, the promising result is either due to stem cell therapy alone or other associated uh, uh, you know therapies and supportive care offered in the covid-19 infections <music>